it's one of those things that takes time to absorb. And at first you think someone's playing a joke on you and uh, then gradually you become very embarrassed by the fact that, you know, I've had so many advantages of being able to go to school in this country, being able to work for the government at CDC, and actually spending an entire lifetime doing things I enjoy doing, and then on top of that to somehow get honored is almost an embarrassment. I've spent the last 50 plus years working in global health. Some of that was on the smallpox eradication program. We worked in Africa and in India and uh, smallpox has been eradicated now for over 30 years. The United States was very important in, with the Soviet Union in getting that program started. And so uh, it, it's a compliment to the U.S. government that they stayed with it. The last 10 years have been the most exciting of all because before that time, few people were actually interested in global health. And with the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, suddenly there were people willing to put money into the research for global health to provide pathways for people that wanted to do something in the field everything has so totally changed that now it's possible to see that the tools will increase tremendously when i was born my baby book shows that there were only two vaccines being used now we routinely use 18 in this country another dozen under certain circumstances and soon it'll be uh, 24 routine and then 30 routine. So the tools are improving. Now we have interest on the part of many people and resources are increasing. I think to be a student now in global health has to be just the perfect thing to do. I tell students consistently that they should try to be generalists and specialists simultaneously. Generalists to try to figure out how the world works, what uh, happens and then follow some passion, but now you know how that passion fits into the general picture. And there are so many things to be done that you really can follow your passion and still improve the world. You don't have to be selfish with that.